to welcome some representatives of Code Pink, another organization that's been with this campaign for years. Here we have Lydia Benjamin, who is the co-founder, Nancy Mancias, who has been campaigning for Bradley Manny hard in the San Francisco Bay Area. So I had an opportunity last week to have a talk with President Obama. Some people said getting into the National Defense University when he was making a major talk about U.S. policy and interrupting the President was rude. What do you think? In, around Guantanamo, you don't have to hide behind the cloak of Congress. You can free those prisoners who've been already cleared for release. That's right. And around the drone strikes, you can just do the right thing, which is down those those damn drones. We don't need them. We don't want them. We were recently. All of the work that we do has been informed by Bradley Manning and WikiLeaks. Recently, we got to go to Pakistan and hear from people in Pakistan how they found out, thanks to Bradley Manning, the connivance of their government with the U.S. on these drone strikes. And then we are able, in, in 10 days, to take a delegation to Yemen, where we'll, we will be meeting with activists who overthrew the dictator when they found out he was working with the U.S. government to try to use drone strikes to kill his opponents. So what we want to do is meet in Yemen with the people who are suffering from U.S. policy, the people who have their loved ones in Guantanamo, the people who are the victims of our drone strikes. And we thank, we will bring the thanks of the people of Yemen to Bradley Manning for helping them understand what democracy is all about and how we have to fight for it. And now I want to introduce Nancy Mencias, who's been working hard on Bradley Manning's campaign from the Bay Area. Oh, we will, we will free you. 
Just because you put the truth up in its place. We will 